Uh, memory integrity, CPU load. Array 17 offline, array 4 drive intermittent response, array 6 drive B7 not responding. I don't know what any of that means to me. Yes? Sorry, I'm just looking at your monitor wall thing. It's kind of cool. Oh. Why do you just have six missiles at your bedside? <laughs> you know, whatever. Better not ask. Oh, what is this? No accounting for taste. Oh, you don't want to play Blast Radius with me, Nick? Play some board games? Cotton yarn. Oh, ice machine? How far down does this go? Is it... Oh, some melon, vodka, and dirty water. Sounds like a meal to me. I assume you're not planning on staying long. Oh, Jesus. There's one of these in every single place that's always like, I don't trust you, guy. Gosh, after a welcome this warm, who wouldn't want to just stay forever? This place isn't for you. Acadia is only as secure as we make it. We take unnecessary risks, we get careless, and things can go bad. Fast. If there's a synth who needs a safe place, then we take them in. Let them live as a synth, without fear. You don't fit that description. That makes you an unnecessary risk. It's nothing personal. Minimizing our contact with outsiders is just practical. God, why is... There really is just one of these in every single group or settlement in this game. You must have tons of friends with this attitude. I don't need friends. Do you have a quest or something? Hey there. You want to buy something or what? Oh, he's a shop. Okay. I'll yeah, what do you got? Sure. It's not much, but it's the best I can do. And I could sell something, maybe? Do I have anything to sell? I guess I dropped off most all my crap. Well, these are valuable, so I could sell some of them. He's only got 4 or 14, but I mean, I could always use more, uh... Here, let's just get rid of this stuff. Why not take that, too? Just take it all. I don't know how long it's going to be before I go back and drop stuff off. There you go. A lot of that stuff I took from them, and I just sold it right back to them. Ooh! Thank you for your stim packs. Very kind of you to... Donate them to my cause. So, I understand you've seen a good bit of our island. What do you think? Not a good bit. I ran to a tannery. Quaint. With sort of an old world, burn it to the ground and salt the earth kind of charm. Hmm. Interesting. Of course it was already burned to the ground once. I'm not sure attempting that again would yield much. None of this you guys island, are good at jokes. with all of its danger and beauty, predates you and I. The ecosystem isn't what it once was, but it has adapted, and it will continue to adapt, long after we're gone. What's important, really important in the long run, is understanding it, and then passing that knowledge All along right. to those what who will follow What do you want me to do? Us. Go get some Yaogwai butts and bring them back to you? If that's what floats your boat. It gives me a sense of purpose, yes. I like having something worthwhile to which I can dedicate my time. I should note that I'm not fully versed in human anatomy. Who? Oh. But I'm your best chance of medical assistance should you require it. Since Dima has approved of you, I'm more than willing to offer help. Alright, so she's the doctor. Let me help you with your stuff. I'd like to help you with your research. Oh, well, that's thoughtful of you. Hmm, okay. What can we have you do? There's a flower native to this island. A species of the genus Aster that has survived remarkably well. Did you name it doesn't yourself quite after have it? The brilliance of color that I understand it once did before. Hmm, well, before the war. I'm personally rather fond of them, but lately have been investigating secondary chemical properties they possess. If you could bring me additional samples, it would speed up my research. I okay. can offer you a meager amount of caps, if that makes the idea more appealing. It's all right. I'll just, I'll just do it. I have some flowers. Do I already have them? Uh, 
I have some flowers for you. These will do nicely. Thank you. Did As promised. Did I get flowers? Here are your caps. Oh, I got it. I got an aster. Maybe I got that last time and just didn't pay attention. Work planter. Hub flowers growing on the walls. Can I set some of these up in my settlements? Because these are pretty you? cool. It's like vertical. Oh. Still collecting asters? I, I don't think I have more, but I'll say it. I have some flowers for you. I'm sorry, is this a joke I'm not in on? If you do actually find any, I'll be happy to take them. I heard before the war you guys had this stuff called sunscreen. Heh. <laughs> yeah? You gonna say anything else, Buttons? You got more to talk about? Excuse me. Yep. Uh, uh, come on, Buttons, please. Can I ask some questions? Ask away. No, oh, he doesn't have anything else to say, does he? All right, I'm just gonna skip cool through this. Name. Intimidating. Oh, oh sorry. Ha -ha. Sorry. It's from a long time ago. My full name is Ethan Gombosh. My last name's oh, I'm trying to translate press the button. Uh. Buttons. A lot of people out here could use a hand. <laughs> sorry, buttons. I didn't mean to just walk away, but I had to. Or you just gonna Sounds keep like talking? Sounds like you got the all clear. So, what's your story? Um, came here looking for Kasumi. Kasumi. Do you guys like to say it that way? I came here looking for Kasumi. Oh, isn't that sweet of you? That Kasumi's a good enough kid, I suppose. A little confused, maybe. But then, aren't we all? Not that anyone's asking, but I'll tell you. It all gets easier to deal with when you realize none of it matters. Oh. Where you are, where you came from, let go of all that, and life gets simple. Oh, he's all about the nihilism. You must be the life of the party around here. Hey, if we had parties, I damn well would be. Anyway, why don't you have I'd parties then? I'm amusing myself with trading. Don't have much to work with, but I'm always happy to make a good deal. Let me know if you need something. I probably won't have it, but let me know anyway. Oh boy. Well, that sounds great. Let's see what you have. You never know. I might actually have something useful. Um, recon marine chest piece. Reduce damage while standing and not moving. Hey, wow. Look at the, the stats on that. Oh my god, value. <laughs> All right, keep going. <laughs> Don't need any of that or that, no. Lots of clothes. Uh, some booze and stuff. Yellow trim plate, bobby pins. All right, well, yeah, you don't really have anything I want. Oh, ha <laughs> ha. Well, let's go down. Kasumi! Hello? Kasumi... Kasumi-chan! Doko desu ka? Wonder glue, yeah. What's this? Bobby pins, wonder glue? Okay. Lots of, lots of adhesives around here. Let's try this way. Hello? Jug. Just jug. What's that thing? Also, can I... Oh, they're very lightweight. <laughs> Lots of just random doodads around here. Ah, oh, but terminal. Tell me something I don't know. Current projects. Fog condensers. Internal motors reworked to correct problems with units becoming off-balance. Dima's proposed upgrades for flow intake integrated. Power consumption reduced. Feedback from Far Harbor representatives taken into consideration. Dima's precise words were noted and ignored. Oh, shit. Dima upgrades. Is he version 351? Vacuum tubes resealed after corrosion noted in multiple locations. Adaptive seating motors recalibrated. No additional instances of Dima becoming entangled in memory access apparatus. So he used to get entangled in his own uh, memory thing. <laughs> power couplings upgraded. Personal note, I am concerned that we are approaching the limits of what Dima's internal power source can safely accommodate. Too much more of this and he risks overworking himself. Oh, past projects. I didn't look at that. Reconstruction Surgery 12. Subject redacted brought in after incident during trip to Acadia. Significant trauma to left arm repaired. Full function restored. Subject V5 brought in. 
Uh, severe trauma to head and upper torso. Cognitive functions impaired. Functionality restored. S2 brought in requesting facial reconstruction surgery completed successfully with minor scarring. Subject satisfied with procedure technique improves with every additional attempt. So what is that about? Are those synths that that happened to? Oh, hey, Nick? Nick? Nick! Where the hell has he gone? Hey, have you seen Katie a synth? Far away from the <laughs> institute that we don't have to worry, right? You seen a synth around here? Detective synth? Weird face? Yellow eyes? God damn it, where'd he go? Buttons, can you help? He didn't like hide behind the door or something, did he? No. Alright, have to remember that's there. So we can come back with Nick later. Oh! Ho ho! What do we got in here? Boxes with nothing. Oh, rat away! Rat poison. Concrete. Well, this is pretty good over here. I can always do first aid. Purified water and duct tape and add some cork right there. You got a thing for antiques, huh? Valentine, come with me. Come on. Actually, I could just activate hey, you. Go ahead. Like this, and see what you can do. Can do. Is he coming around? There he is. Come on in, Nick. Let's see what you can do. Dog meat. Let him in there. Serious subroutines running on this box. Maybe. Let's try a slightly different approach. All right, I'm just gonna have some coffee while you're at that. Dog needs to stop playing around. Not that either. See about this. Sorry, can't bust it. What? You got the other one. Try again. Hey. One. Need your expertise. Good thing. Try it again. I could offer you some coffee if that'll help you. Sorry, boss. This one's beyond me. What? Can you try one more time, or is it just gonna be like, nope? Heads up. There's something you need. Hack that terminal. Good plan. Cause he was, he was getting close. I think the first time. Walked out of this one. No, it only gives him one chance, I guess. Oh well. What else we got? Oh, that's the up the way up every day's a struggle here but at least we don't have to hide mm. oh all oh. let's be her back there so I'm gonna look over this way <gasps> Kasumi reroute the sensors we've got some Techno mumbo jumbo. Kasumi, Energy Connor? output on these things are terrible. Who designed this? Sorry, I'm right in the middle of something. Yep. Oh, all right, take a look at her face. Come on. Uh, what are you working on? You don't belong here. Your parents sent me. I'm a detective. What's that you're working on? Just trying to cobble some pre-war junk into something usable. Now, do you mind telling me what you're doing here? Um. I'm a detective. I was hired to find you. Your parents. You're what? You wanted me to come and find you. For me? Look, my mom and dad. I, I mean, those people that were taking care of me, they wouldn't want me back. Not if they knew the truth. You know, even if they're not your actual parents, they still took care of you, so that means that they're your parents. Although, they were very sure that you came from your mother, like, you know, birthed from your mother. You can work it out with your parents. What do you mean? Listen to me, because you're not their daughter, you're a synth. Hello? What do you mean? I'm not their daughter. I'm a synth. I thought if I just left, it would be easier for them. How would that conversation have gone anyway? I've been lying to you this whole time. Your real daughter is dead and I replaced her? 
Uh, do you have any proof? You're confused. Everyone has doubts who they are. You haven't replaced anyone. I know this must be hard for you. I just want to make sure you're here for the right reasons. Do you have any proof that you're actually a synth? Little things. Dreams of waking up in a lab. Years I can't remember from when I was a kid. <laughs> Not to mention how I never quite fit in back at home. You know, most people don't quite fit in. <laughs> I know it must be hard for you. I just want to make sure you're here for the right reasons. Yeah, so I am. I mean, yes, I believe I'm a synth, but there's something wrong here with Acadia. There's more going on than just the refuge. I can't leave until I've gotten to the bottom of it. I've done enough running. So there's something going on? What, I, what's going on? Yeah, what kind of problem? It's your choice. You're coming with me. Something's going on. I can help. What kind of problem is there in Acadia? It's a long story. I just have to figure out how to... Wait. Wait, you find things. I am a detective. That's what you do, right? That's me. That's why you came after me. Yep. What if I told you that there's a secret? Oh. A big secret. How big? On this island. Something way more important than just one lost girl. Okay... <laughs> Sister, there's a lot of... <laughs> oh, no. That's kind of rude, but I have to. Sister, there's a lot of things on this island more important than you. If you could just hold the jokes for a second. You saw <laughs> Sorry, I can't help myself. Up to, right? They hold his memories or offload data from his brain. Or maybe some combination of both? Well, Faraday asked me to help do some repairs on them. And, you know, I got curious. There's like a century's worth of life experience. Yeah, he's like a hundred years and old. That's when I see it. Data models Dima has been making. One was the fog taking over Far Harbor. Another was a nuclear detonation on the island. Plus, death counts. What if Dima is so open and welcoming because he's actually hiding something from us? A plan to wipe out the rest of the island. Then why would he give him the fog condensers? Uh, you don't trust him. Personally, I found calculated mass murder to be very soothing. <laughs> None of this sounds like my problem, but I'll help if I can. Personally, I find calculated mass murder to be very soothing. Look, help me out, and if I'm wrong, you can make all the jokes you want. Oh, I'll do it no, anyway. I've don't worry. Doing some digging on my oh, own, Nick. I haven't had much luck. I keep seeing Dima, Faraday, and Chase head into the laboratory at the other end of the hall. Then they come out later looking like they've been arguing. There's actually a storage space right next to there. It'd be a perfect spot to hide an eavesdrop, but it's been locked up. I've also tried breaking into Faraday's terminal, since he and Dima are so close, but the security on it is crazy. Um, well, I mean, they left the key out, I have it, and also, didn't we get into Faraday's terminal and not understand what it was talking about? Despite knowing next to nothing about hacking, I'm really confident that's my best option. Uh, something meeting the next meeting sounds like our best bet. Already have the key. It's be easier if we talk to Dima. Your eavesdropping on the next meeting sounds like our best bet. I already found the key to that room. You did? Great. Come back as soon as you found anything. Okay. Oh man. Okay. So I can. Can I do all of them, or do I have to just choose one? I'm going to do this one first, and then if I can do the others, I'm going to do them as well. Is this the spot? And it doesn't really show a, a marker inside. Because that was the storage room, right? Let's turn off all the extra, um, extra bits. I guess that was it then? There's no, no others that are active? Alright, let's go up then, see what's up there. There's one like right here? Or maybe that is somewhere else? 
This goes outside, yeah. I mean, yeah, we've already hacked this, so... Faraday's journal. This wasn't here before. Come on. Uh, things are bad. Far Harbor and the Children of Adam are at the brink of warring with each other, and we're caught in the middle. It's the fog condensers. We just wanted to protect these those people from being wiped out by the fog, but the Children of Adam think that that's an affront to their god. They want the fog to spread all over the island, specifically Far Harbor, and the people of Far Harbor hate them right back. They blame the Children of Adam for spreading the fog, even though that's scientifically unlikely. If Confessor Martin was still in charge of the Children of Adam, we might have better chances. Dima and the old Confessor go way back. Martin was the one who found Dima in the old submarine base, and when Acadia was founded, it was Dima who gifted Martin and his followers with a base to serve as their new home. They renamed the base the Nucleus, and we were originally excited to be working together, making the island a safer place for everyone. But now Confessor Martin has disappeared, and High Confessor Tectus has taken charge. He's a dangerous megalomaniac who wants to destroy Far Harbor at all costs, and he's been threatening us to help or threatening us to help him. Worse, Dima left behind his original memory banks in the Nucleus when he left to found a Of course he did. He blames himself for his lack of judgment, but he's too hard on himself. The Children of Adam were our friends back when Martin was in charge, and those memory banks would have been difficult to transport. Dima had plenty of reason to believe they would be safe locked behind the pre-war defenses that Martin promised to never tamper with. Dima has been found on this island. Er, sorry. Dima has been on this island more than a century. Anything could be in those memory banks. If the Children of Adam find a way to access all the data, they could find something that would threaten the whole island. We're running out of time. I'm convinced Dima. I've convinced Dima that we need to send someone to get his memories back. Interfacing with Dima's offloaded data won't be easy for someone else, so we're working on a computer program together. The program includes a set of instructions that Dima is going to make to help our agent once they're inside the simulation. Oh, so that's another one of those kind of like going into Kellogg's brain things. It'll also need tools to hack through the internal security protocols that the memory banks have. I think we should send Chase, but Dima thinks that's too risky. The children of Adam know her, and if she's spotted, then it's war. We need to send someone else, if possible, but who? I think you mean, but whom? Oh, let's take it. Can I still do the other optionals? I can still talk to Dima. Alright, well then... Do I want to talk to Dima? I mean... I've been told the Valentine Detective Agency signs... Oh, well, sun's out. Sword. Better visibility. Sure for better or worse. I don't know why you're bringing up the your sign, and I don't know what you mean with the sun being out. That is not the sun buttons. I'm gonna talk to him anyway. 